Hey everyone, this is Snake Kid Future Breeding, and in this video, I just wanted to talk about my girl. Her name is Renee. This is my Kenyan sand boa. Some of you guys might have seen her feeding videos. Um, she actually didn't eat uh, either times I tried to fit, feed her this past week, and so I got a little worried. Uh, I did some research. I was looking at her, handling her. And I noticed some bubbling in the mouth, some hard times breathing, and I was like, I think she has a respiratory infection. I gave her, I gave um, the local vet a call, and I have an appointment tomorrow at 10 a.m., so hopefully everything's going to be okay and it's nothing too serious. I did put sand in here today. Because I think the um, the dry eco earth was just getting in her mouth a little bit too much, causing a little bit of stress. So I upped the t temps. I have two ceramic heat bulbs on there now. The temperature is about 98. Um, they say when if they have a respiratory infection to up the temperature a little more than it should be, just to kind of give them that little bit of comfort. So. Hopefully she's going to be okay, and I will give you guys an updated video on that tomorrow. Um, and yeah, uh, I also, just while I'm here, an update on this little guy. This is my super hypo red tail. Um, he's a couple months old, and I named him Ragnarok. And he's just, he was actually... He was actually was a dick when I first got him, but now he's he's chilled out pretty nice. So super happy with him. Love him to death. Have him in this just kind of uh, forty gallon tank, and his temperature with about eighty two. And then this is my guy. Uh, this is my guy Reese, my ball python. He's he's pretty chill. I've had him the longest. I've had him for about a year. So yeah. Um, He's a big part of my life. When I first got him, he was just like a gift. I was I was so happy with him and snake collection getting larger and larger every day. But uh, yeah, guys, that's uh, just an update on my snakes and um, hopefully this girl's gonna be all right. Um, just got her, so too bad. Hopefully uh, nothing too bad's going on. Um, I might do a contest pretty soon. I have a couple spare water bowls and like leaves and stuff and. Um, you, uh, Yuma Blood and um, True Outdoor, um, True Outdoorsman, uh, they have really inspired me to try to do a contest, so I definitely want to do that and uh, give them a shout out and definitely go follow them guys. But uh, yeah, I have a water bowl and stuff, and so yeah, well, have a good night guys, and I'll give you an update on Renee tomorrow. Peace out.